brand new beautiful building right behind me with a whole range of high-tech amenities inside but this is a complex that has certainly sparked some controversy in the past this cop academy is not what garfield park wants or needs that was then in 2018 and this is now we are reaffirming our commitment to investing in our uh, best in trash class training and development of our first responders. A ribbon cutting ceremony getting underway today for an investment worth at least $128 million on this 30 acre complex at Kilburn and Chicago Avenues. <laughs> Which will be home to a new training facility for police and fire recruits. Another benefit, as you heard, is that our police and fire recruits are going to be able to train and work together before they become sworn members of their respected departments, which has never happened before in a meaningful way. Now it will be systematic and baked into their daily training. Those against the project felt the money could be better spent elsewhere in this community. But the measure was approved anyway. Now, inside, the amenities are state-of-the-art, including an elevator shaft to practice rescues, the ability to fill rooms with smoke and flames, and even a replica village in which different real-world scenarios can be acted out. This is the kind of training that our first responders deserve. But this training facility hopefully will put COPA out of business. Names like French, Busio and Jimenez will line the streets of that model village, a dedication to fallen first responders, their families among those gathered here today. Our officers needed this sorely, especially since the last two or three years, they've heard loud voices say, we don't support you. And this shows that you do. And as future generations are trained to serve the city, a new boys and girls club will grow alongside them here as well. Because as they are coming and going from their club activities, they will get a chance to see first responders who can relate to them and hopefully spark a dream to one day serve this great city as a firefighter, a paramedic, or a police officer. In West Humboldt Park, Runa Tumulty, WGN News.